A Canon image formula scanner and capture on touch can scan a batch of documents and then save them as separate files. To start, launch capture on touch. I'm going to create a new document type so I can save my batch scanning settings. Click the pencil icon to edit your settings and click the batch separation tab. First, you're gonna choose the separation method. I'm going to scan a stack of receipts, so I'm just going to use the counter method and choose to separate every new page. Capture on Touch sees each side of a document as a different page. So if you use the counter, multiply your number by two, so both sides of the same document are in the same file. Or choose simplex scanning in your document scanning settings for Capture on Touch to ignore the second side. For documents that are different length of pages, you can choose to read a barcode that it recognizes. Uh, you'll have to set that up in the detail settings. You can use Zone OCR to look for certain characters. Again, you set that up in the detail settings. You can use a patch code, insert a blank page, or use the front of page where it will insert a separator when it detects the front page. On the counter, I'm going to choose my number of pages as one. If you selected the blank page as your separator, you will need to tell Capture on Touch what to do with it here. The head separation checkbox determines whether the separator will be inserted at the beginning of the document or at the end. The document settings are where I can choose simplex for the scanning. I could make other changes here, like detect automatically on the color, and I'm going to give it a name, and then click close to save it. Next, you'll need to pick your output and choose your file name settings. Select your output and click the pencil icon, or you can set up a new output. Click the Detail Settings button in the File Name Folder Name section. You can string together elements from this list here to create file names by selecting an item and clicking the Add button. I've got my file name set up with a date, a character string, and a counter. And my file names are going to look like this here. You can choose other options like time, a username, a scanner name, a computer name. You can set up automatic detection of a certain area of the scan page to create the document name using OCR. Obviously, this will work best if all the scan documents have the same format. Click OK to save your name settings. You'll want to make sure that you have the correct destination folder for your documents and then click Close to save your settings. Then place your documents and scan. Capture on Touch will automatically separate your scan according to the choices you made in the batch separation settings. When you click the Finish button, your scan documents will be saved according to the naming convention you set up in your output. 